So hopefully you've done some rows of stockinettes where you're just purling a row, knitting a row, purling a row, knitting a row, getting comfortable with knit and purl. Now I'm going to show you how to go back and forth so that you can do things like ribbing, seed stitch, So my yarn is in the knit position. I'm going to knit one, purl one. So knit one. Now my next stitch is a purl one. I'm going to use my left thumb. I'm going to bring this to the front. Now I can purl one. Left thumb, pop it to the back, knit one. Pop, purl, pop, knit. So this is why ribbing is much faster and easier in Portuguese because it's just a super quick, smooth movement to go back and forth between your knit, purl. If you are finding that you are having a lot of yarn overs in your work, that's advanced, that's the next section, but it also means that you are forgetting to pop your yarn to the correct position for your next stitch. So to the back, knit, to the front, 